Yo, 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 my Star Citizens and Noob Gamers. Welcome back to another episode of Star Citizen with me, Menix. And in today's episode, I'm on 3.2 in the PTU. And we're going to test out some of the new salvage missions that they've got, which is the hull scraping for the Nine Tails, part of the personal ones, and um, see if we can do this in my Vulture. So yeah, so we hope you like this video, guys. If you do like this video, don't forget to take that point to tickle that like button for us, as always. Don't forget to hit the bell, sus bell and subscribe notification for more videos as we drop them. And check out the description for the Discord link and the membership if you want to help join the channel. And uh, yeah, so let's get into it, guys. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get out my salvage uh, vulture. And I'm going to pick up one of the new jobs they've got here in the 3.2 war, which is coming. I'm currently in the PTU and we've got these new ones coming up. So we've got to go over to the personal, which is the illegal in air quotes. And we'll go over to here and we've got the Aegis Hammerhead one, which is going to net you around 250 grand plus bonuses, plus whatever you get in salvage. And then you've got this Andromeda one, and sometimes it'll come up with a Cutty Black as well. A Cutty Black one will come up. So I'm going to let that timer run out and see if the Cutty Black one comes out. And what I'm going to do is grab my ship first and then go from there. Welcome have to look. the ASOP Vehicle Retrieval System. Straight Vulture. Your insurance claim has been yeah, sent. Let's spend that. Your vehicle has been moved to our storage facility. Vehicle select. Your vehicle has been deployed. So there we go. Game. So there's a couple of things they've done here. I, I like. I'm liking the new look. Every if you when I hit escape, you see everything's just really clean. Same with the uh, where it's telling me where my ship is. It's really really clean as well. We can now hit lifts with my pad as well with my pad button what was we on three so i can use my pad now to hit lifts as well which is really really good and also i'm going to show you some other things they've got going on you yeah, like in your helmet hood so i've currently got a helmet on there and what they've got in here is they've got a new hood which i will show you And it only seems to work with some ships. It didn't work with my Pisces earlier on when I was in that. But it seems to be working fine with this one. And what we'll see is when I turn my ship on, you'll see in the top here we have this new HUD here, which is this one here and this one this side, which is the, them and you. I only see, I've only seen it in a couple of ships. I've not seen. I didn't see it in my Pisces earlier. But what it is is, if I move my head around, it's actually my helmet hood that it's in my helmet incorporated into my helmet. And I'll show you that by taking off my helmet in a minute. I mean, I'm a half and half on this because I do have a um, head movement cam, so I can look down at my MFDs. So it's almost like it's taking away the the, the MFDs, but I can see what they, why they're doing it for those that don't have a tracking and stuff like that. So if I get out of this now, out my out my sea. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take my helmet off. Get back in my seat and you'll see then. And you'll see now that's going to wear. So if it doesn't know you, you can just take your helmet off. As long as you um, have the atmosphere stuff. As long as you don't, like, you've got gravity or or, or air in your cockpit because there is some things that don't have them and you'll end up dying. So that's that. And another thing I want to show you as well, another thing they've done with the HUD. Really, really good. I like this, this new, this new one. They also now have, if I press, um, I'm going to turn my eye tracker off. If I press to my quantum drive, you'll see now that the circle thing has gone. They have now don't have that. They just have the top and the bottom and then the one that comes down here. And I think that's much, much better. Getting rid of that circle. Right, so I'm going to get land ticket. Launch. Launch complete. Launch complete. 
I'm going to pick up this job as well while I'm here. Let's go to the contracts manager. Let's go to the personal and see if that cutty black one has come up. Colors black clean up. There we are. I prefer this one, a smaller ship. So I'm going to accept that one. Please visit again. And I'm over at uh, Seraphine. So, and these always come up around Jella. So that's good. So what I've got is I've got an hour to get over there, get it cleaned up, pick up any salvage I want to pick up. And I'll get 80 grand plus bonuses from that. So let's find where it is. So let's find where this is. That's easy one. Right, so now we just gotta look for this ship. So in this, they've removed your ping, and now you have to keep hold of V. You have to press V to actually find it to, to do your ping. What was what tab is now is now they've changed in it. They're changing it to be, I think, bringing up your um, Morbi glass. It works when you're in first person uh, on foot, but not when you are in your ship at the moment. But that's what they're changing it to. So you have to keep hold of V or press V, should I say, or keep hold of it and then let go, and then it'll do it. Even though that switches you to your thingy mode, your checking, uh, scanning mode. So I've got a lot of changing buttons to do once this comes out live. So we've got 57 minutes left and I've got a bar at the top there and what I'm going to do is when I go into my mining mode now I'm going to switch to my braids because they're bigger and, and scrape faster so so yeah we are trespassing just remember that it is an illegal mission so it is the cutty black and if I press V and get a scan on that. So it doesn't look like there's any cargo on board. So let's just go straight into mining mod. Begin. We've got an hour. I may rush this on for you guys so you don't see me watch me doing it, but I'll put some music on in the background as well. They tell me that I'm never gonna make it. They want me to do something that can make sense. They hate when I keep dreaming, I'll be famous. But I don't give a fuck, I'ma keep chasing. I 
got all this potential, it's deep inside of me But they hate when you're successful cause they try to be They sit there being just mental because you're trying things And they just want you to settle and do the right thing So get a good job, don't slack off Wake up every morning, make a good impression on your boss Don't do anything that I wouldn't do And when you make your money, make sure you don't spend it too soon <laughs> Fuck that, I'll do what I wanna do I got a different path from everyone and that includes you who are you to tell me how to live life? In these times, it feels like nobody is right, yeah So I'ma figure out what else we succeed And then invest all of my time into that and proceed I need whatever the hell can make me happy And I don't think you have a clue, what could that be? They tell me that I'm never gonna make it So the game crashed on me for the fifth time, uh, fourth time. So you can see here, I've got four other jobs that I tr that show, say it shows abandoned. I didn't abandon, basically I got 50, uh, 30k crashes. So I'm gonna quickly jump into it and try again and see uh, if I can get another one in. If not, then I'll um, obviously call it a day. Uh, I'll rush it forward so that it gets done so that you don't um, see me doing it and I'll push it towards the end. That's if I can get it done. If not, I'm going to call it a day anyway. So here I am back at the place. I'm just going to head towards the salvage thing now. It, the servers have just become really unstable. Obviously, I'm in the PTU, but how can you test stuff if you're constantly being crashed out and it just becomes irritating and makes you not want to actually play it? or even test it and yeah that's me done okay so we already like this video guys if you did like this video don't forget to take that point to tickle that like button first don't forget to hit the bell and subscribe notification for more videos as we drop them i'm going to probably head over to the peu for some stability which is weird to say and so we'll uh, see you guys out in the verse